through one of their expressions is um, an exploration of uh, who each of them are, their story, uh, what they might be thinking. It took about a year and a half and it is carbon pencil on just roll uh, sheets of paper. I buy them in large rolls. It's all the pieces are hand cut. It probably has about a thousand individually cut pieces per square foot. Everything has to be made on the wall. So I'll fix the light first and then place a paper so this is a 60-foot wolf ch moose chase reduced to a 15-foot footprint so I can bring it to you. Every lantern represented a hope or a dream of someone in the community. Then we invite the community to come down and they launch the hopes and the dreams of the community together. If one horse, let's see, that one, that's not enough of an effect. And what do a group of horses do? They run around. They, how about a stampede? That's how it started, the thinking, the process. It's an experience. You have to be in it. Come and see it. Even if you don't like it, that's fine. But come and see it. Well, I'm still, you know, every painting I do, I, I want to learn more, you know. And I'm always trying something, something different, something new. 32 years of let everyone touch, especially children. How's a child ever going to get respect for anything if you can't touch it? And uh, listen up, you guys out there, you rescue artists. I know you love your work, but children don't break things. Grown-ups do. <laughs> Our prize is an amazing event. Just so grateful to be here. Kind of surprised, but I was, I was very humbled. Just wonderful to know that um, the people have responded to my work. I want art that you can automatically contact with within one second. We are not artists by trade, so this was uh, a big leap for us. Follow your passion, don't give up because it, it can lead to other things. It always somehow has to touch me, myself and hopefully that will happen when somebody's watching it. And I think people should just vote for their favorite piece, whatever, whatever it may be. And you've turned your city into an art mecca. And my hat's off to you.